Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to add SSL and HTTPS in WordPress. So now you know that Google is enforcing HTTPS sites in their result instead of a regular HTTP website. And now many webmasters and stores are now pushing for HTTPS. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up HTTPS for your domain in cPanel if you have any other hosting then you have to unfortunately go with different set of instructions so this is my cPanel and as you can see it looks slightly different than older version so you can change the theme to the old one and your display will change for me this is paper lantern theme that I'm using here okay so the first thing that we are going to do here is to find options for let's encrypt so I'm going to check that now you can also search for SSL in your cPanel simply by typing let's encrypt now you can click on this let's encrypt SSL and it should take you to that page Now here, I want you to check for your domain name that you want to issue this certificate for. Okay, in my case, this is the first domain where I want to issue that and I'm going to... But before that, we have to add few things there. Uh, for example, in our dashboard, we have to download the plugin known as really simple SSL and for that you have to search for really simple SSL okay as you can see we have really simple SSL which you can Click on it once you set up your SSL certificate. Now let's go back to cPanel and issue our SSL certificate. Now here you will find one button named issue. So click on that and here it will ask you whether you want to include domain name which are part of this such as your subdomain and both www and without it okay so you can check all of those and you can also keep the default as is now i'm going to click on issue and it should take care of the rest Now that it will show you the message, this SSL certificate is installed and it's, it is using the IP address. Now, in order to make these changes, you have to simply click on this really simple SSL plugin installation button, install now, and it should start installing that plugin. Click on activate. Okay. Now it will also ask you ready to migrate to SSL. Now you can click on go ahead and activate SSL. Okay, now it will say SSL activated. Don't forget to change your settings in Google Analytics Webmaster Tools. Okay, so you can ignore that part. And now you can check your settings here for links or for general okay it will force you to log in again now because it wants you to check this HTTPS works for your domain or not so you have to log in again and on this page you will find that your SSL is now activated it also shows you this 
HTTPS on both WordPress and site address. Now, if you go to visit your site, you will find that it is now having your SSL. As you can see, you can confirm that in URL bar that your website has HTTPS on almost every pages that you are going to click from here onwards. You can try this, but for that, let's go back and see what you need. In your cPanel, you need Let's Encrypt SSL feature. If your host is not offering that, then you may not be able to follow along with the steps in here. Also, you have to install this really simple SSL plugin. And rest of the stuff is very easy. As you can see, if you have followed my video up to this point, then you can see it's very easy to set up your SSL.